Happening right now, dozens of people are checking out the art and wine walk in downtown Sioux Falls. This is a live look at the first Friday event along Phillips Avenue. A few folks out there, Kel Lance, Sophie Heineman talks with a local artist about what it means to be part of this event. With the spring weather, downtown Sioux Falls is hoping people will come out to enjoy tonight's art and wine walk. When it's summertime, I like to paint outside. Yeah. Elizabeth Zokaitis is one of this year's featured artists, taking part for a second time. I've been doing art for ever, basically, since I was little, um, but professionally about three years. While her art isn't displayed in a studio, instead she's fortunate to show and sell her art out at Thomas James and Bechtold Jewelry, where she works full time. I interviewed with Thomas. He uh, already knew that I was an artist because he'd seen my artwork. And that was part of the draw for both of us because we do so much custom jewelry here at Bechtold's that it was just a natural fit. In addition to featuring her artwork, the jewelry store will offer hors d'oeuvres and wine for visitors this evening. It'll be one of many stops people will hopefully make their way to. There are 30 downtown locations, so various businesses, and each business is the host to one local artist. And you'll get to browse around the shop, take a look at what that artist is creating, and you'll get to sample some wine. And with this week marking National Travel and Tourism Week, Tenley Schwartz with Downtown Sioux Falls says this event benefits the area as a whole. People will come specifically for it and then they'll see, hey, I really enjoy this city, I enjoy downtown, and they'll come back for something else and they'll keep returning because once you show up here, you see how fun and exciting it can be. In Sioux Falls, Sophie Heineman, Kelloland News. The Art and Wine Walk goes until 8 o'clock.